December 2004, an earthquake in the Indian Ocean sets off a tsunami that takes the lives of more than 230,000 people. March 2011, a magnitude 9 earthquake shakes northeastern Japan, unleashing a wave that kills 18,000. In both cases, victims either drowned or were crushed to death by debris. While natural disasters like this are sure to happen again, a local company is hoping they've invented a way one could survive when it hits. I just think in this day and age, we should have some way of reducing the number of deaths that do occur. For aerospace expert Julian Sharp, the idea to create a way to live through a tsunami first came to him while listening to the waves on Cannon Beach. I thought to myself, well, if I can't hear the waves anymore, we should really think about heading up the hill. But that thought turned into an even bigger idea. With my aerospace engineering skills, it should be possible to design and build something which can ride out a tsunami. And he did. It's called the survival capsule, a sphere-like ball where people can ride out the chaos that a tsunami or other natural disasters create. The structure is made out of aluminum. It comprises of aluminum hemispheres, spun sheet metal, and brought over an aluminum tubular frame that we designed. You can pretty much heat this material up to about 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit on one side, and you can touch the other side. The interior of the capsule, there's a seat per person with a four-point harness strap. There is room for storage of water supplies, food, and pretty much anything else you think you might need. The capsule was conceived and designed down at the company's headquarters in Mukilteo, then went through a series of rigorous tests. We worked with a local tsunami expert. We came up with a series of load cases, which we then subjected the capsule to. From dropping it from various heights to general seaworthiness, the survival capsule is built to withstand any situation. This capsule is designed for people with maybe five minutes warning. The idea is that you tether this capsule, whether you have it in your garden or on the roof of your office building, but it really allows you to use your tsunami capsule and remain pretty much in the same location. With designs for eight and even 10-man capsules, the lives it could save add up quickly. There are many opportunities for this capsule to uh, protect people and, and give people a, a chance. It's a product one hopes you'll never have to use, but Julian hopes their survival capsule could make all the difference. If we can save some lives, that would be just the best thing ever.